Well, as we know, someone could wake up tomorrow with their life changed forever. Tonight's Mega Millions jackpot is worth $1.1 billion, and that can feed a lot of dreaming. So John Shumway is looking into your odds versus your chances of actually taking that money home. Yeah, and it's an important distinction. There is a difference between odds and chances. The key to the whole thing is to go in as a fun exercise without expectations. When the jackpots reach the stratosphere of hope, associate professor of mathematical sciences at CMU, Michael Young, says his phone rings. This, this happens quite often, and I, I give them the same truth that I'm giving you. Dr. Mark Glickman at the Harvard University Department of Statistics gets the calls, too. You're a math guru. Tell me how to win this thing. Well, I think all the smart people realize that there's pretty much no help I can give them. Um, because there's nothing you can do to improve the odds. Okay, let's start with the odds. There's about um, 302 million ways that the, the balls can be drawn. The probability that you would win the lottery on any one pick is going to be one in 303 million. Those are the odds, but can you improve your chances? You absolutely can by buying more tickets. If you buy more lottery tickets, of course, that improves your chances. Buy 10 tickets, you have 10 chances, but each chance still has that same one in 303 million odds. Are you going to buy a ticket? I, I, I will buy a ticket. It's hard to see an opportunity to earn a billion dollars come by and, and not do something, especially if it only costs $2. Absolutely, and all that said, the experts do have a couple of suggestions for us, and coming up, we're gonna talk about how you can reduce the chance of having to share your winnings with somebody else, and something about the annuity payout that you probably don't know. That first check wouldn't be anywhere close to what you're thinking. I'm taking hmm. notes just in case. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> you want right. to be prepared. <laughs> so let's talk about the tax hit because we know that's coming too. Oh uh, yeah, the feds want to get their share 37%. They only withhold 24%. So then you're going to have to come up with the other 13% of tax time. I think you'll be able to handle it. And rough numbers, 1.1 billion. Take the cash option, okay. 648 million. Minus the taxes, you walk away with a check for three hundred and eighty-nine million ish. It's not bad. That sounds fantastic. <laughs> Take the edge off. <laughs> Be sure to join All the right. KDK News team at eleven tonight for the winning Mega Millions numbers. Ken Rising the gang will have those and your local news and weather right here on KDKA.